Hello, 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 everybody. I want to welcome you all to a bonus episode. I was not expecting to be able to do this quite this quick on Phantom Hourglass, but uh, I have just come over to the treasure teller here. I appraised both the dark pearl loop and the Zora scale here. I sold the one Goron Amber that I already have, but if we take a look at this for my file, he gives me a 800 rupees for this thing. So I'll gladly sell that. And he also, for the Zora scale, gives me 800 rupees. Gladly would sell that any day of the week. So now we're up already 1,600 rupees from what we did uh, have before, which was about 1,100. Oh. No problem. A little extra bonus on the bonus content there. Another spot to go uh, treasure hunting for. Now, I saw somewhere that on weekends and weekdays, there are specific times of day where a certain interloper appears. You're going to notice Beetle, his icon's been replaced by the Mast Ship character. And with that said, we got something that we're gonna go ahead and buy. Two things, actually. And I'm looking at both of them. Top left, top right. Hello. So, immediately, heart container, 1,500 rupees. Since we just got 1,600, we'll gladly buy this. So we just completely restored our energy and increased our capacity for hearts by one. We will also buy this 500 rupees. Gladly. Let's see what this is. Iron hull, 150 rupees. Um. Hmm. So I don't really care to collect ship parts like this, but just so I have something new, we'll go ahead and buy this. And then I could probably make a profit of 10 rupees on that. And then if we come right back in here, he should be selling a golden potion. And another sh uh, ship chart? A ship piece? So the gold potion here is 200 rupees, yellow. Replenishes all hearts. It's better than a red potion, but it does not revive you if you get felled. What do we have here? Spike handrail. Honestly, because I think we're going to be getting a lot more treasure later. Again, this is still a bonus episode, so I'm just preparing. Yeah, I'll just go ahead and buy that. We'll get a purple potion later. So we are... Well, we have a red potion already. Okay, so red and yellow. Let's see if he spawns anything else to get. Okay, no. He's completely sold out. We're good to go. Th um, I'm gonna have to go over in the real uh, next episode again, but I do... You know what? Yeah, no, that that can wait until, uh, until I begin again. That was uh, bonus episode number two for Phantom Hourglass. I think bonus episode three, we're gonna cover the Wayfaring Island. Let's check the sea chart real quick. This island here, with a big circle on it, that's the Wayfaring Island. There's access to a fishing rod, access to the third bomb upgrade, and eventually down the line, I think there's a heart container in there, and also a gem of some sort. We'll work on that later, but that will do it 
for this bonus episode. I want to thank you all for watching, and I'm going to prep to go into the next dungeon. And I may put this video up after that video goes up, so yeah. No promises, or I might put this bonus episode up 15 minutes before the real episode goes up. I, I haven't decided yet, but it, I'll uh, I'll have everything set up before you even see it. So, anyway, yeah. Drop a like if you enjoyed it. It was nice and short, all things considered, compared to the last one. Uh, drop a comment if you have anything you want me to, uh, to cover, or uh, just if you have something to say, I'm always listening. Uh, best way to support me, specifically, is to consider subscribing. Uh, you don't have any obligation to do so, so don't feel pressured. Next episode, we're going to do stuff and things regarding uh, the third dungeon. Next full episode, that is. And, uh, yeah, I want to thank you all once again for watching, and bye bu bu bye bye